you're drowning, you don't actually inhale until right before you black out. It's called voluntary apnea. It's like no matter how much you're freaking out, the instinct to not let any water in is so strong that you won't open your mouth until you feel like your head's exploding. And when you finally do let it in, that's when it stops hurting. It's not scary anymore. It's, it's actually kind of peaceful. Are you saying you hope Matt felt some peace in his last moments? I don't feel sorry for him. Can you feel sorry for the nine-year-old Matt who drowned? Just because a bunch of dumbasses dragged him into a pool when he couldn't swim doesn't really give him the right to go off killing him one by one. And by the way, my dad told me that they found a bunch of pictures of Allison on Matt's computer. And not just of her, though. I mean, he photoshopped himself into these pictures. Stuff like them holding hands and kissing. You know, like he had built this whole fake relationship. So yeah, maybe drowning when he was nine years old was what set him off the rails, but the dude was definitely riding the crazy train. One positive thing came out of this, though, right? I still feel like there's something wrong between us. Uh, it's just like tension when we talk. Same thing with Scott. Have you talked to him since that night? No, not really. I mean, he's got his own problems to deal with, though.